my god things lifestyle vlogs unboxing and reviews you in the right place don't forget to go ahead and subscribe below because i do post two times a week that's sunday and thursday at 9 a.m mountain standard time so 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 if y'all clicked on today's video y'all already know i'm coming back today with another yes another on case unboxing plus review for my iphone 14 pro max Yes, I will make sure I link this case down below in the description box just in case anybody want to go ahead and grab it. Y'all know the drill. So if y'all interested in anything I just said, go ahead and stay tuned. But before we go ahead and get into today's video, do not forget to go ahead and give this video a huge thumbs up because it does let me know that y'all are interested in this type of content here on my channel. And y'all definitely trying to see some more in the future. So let's not waste the time. Let's go ahead and hop right into today's unboxing. Let's go ahead and put my deep purple iPhone 14 Pro Max on the scene. And this is going to be the on case that we will be unboxing today. As y'all can see, this box is a big one. Let's go ahead and get some close-ups of this case inside the box before we go ahead and get inside the box. If y'all can hear that leaf blower in the background, please disregard that. This is a really thick box. It's given heavy duty. It's given the protection is gonna be there. Let's look at the back. So this case is claiming it can sustain a 21 foot drop. Now, y'all know how I feel about that. I usually take these things with a grain of salt, but seeing as this case is kind of given like an out of box type case, which any out of box case I ever had always did what it said it was gonna do, I have very high hopes for this case. Okay. Okay. And this case was actually recommended to me. Let's actually just go ahead and get inside the box because I, I can't wait. Okay y'all, so we got it out the box so far and it's a little bit more of a process to actually get it completely taken apart. So let's go ahead and do that. So it looks like it does come with some type of instructions, which I don't need because I know how to you know work these cases. So let's go to the side. Anytime I ever had an out of box case, I never, ever, 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 ever use this clip so if anybody had this case or any out of box cases let me know down in the comment section below if y'all actually ever use this So this is what this case is looking like outside of the box. Let's go ahead and get some more close-ups. I'm almost positive that it does have a raised camera bump, which is great. Since it's clear, we will be able to see that deep purple iPhone. Okay, we do have the cover for that volume on and volume off button buttons feeling how they feeling let's go ahead and try this case on like i said it's more of a process to get this off oh so maybe we supposed to you know what this is why you're supposed to read instructions because you go into it thinking you know what you're doing and then you actually don't but I believe this says separate, so let's. All right, child, we back and I got it separated. So yeah, I did have to just basically pull on this little piece. Um, I feel like it's 
kind of difficult to get it all the way separated. I don't know if it's because I ain't reading instructions or what, but y'all read the instructions. <laughs> so this is what it's looking like off. Let's go ahead and try it on. My microfiber cloth to get this a little decent. This is what this case is looking like on my deep purple iPhone 14 Pro Max. Y'all, I'm not gonna lie, like, I just worked up a whole sweat, like, I'm sweating right now. Let's do some close-ups of this case with the phone in it. This case is super duper bulky, y'all. Like, like my phone is well, the phone been heavy, but it's heavier now. So as y'all can see, it does have a raised camera bump, like I said, but y'all know I got that camera lens protector up on there. And if you don't have one, I will have that link down below along with a screen protector. So from the sides, I feel like you can't really tell that it's a purple iPhone. Cut outs on the bottom is just right. And as y'all can see, there's not like a little flap or anything for like a charging port. You're supposed to just Stick the charger right through this little um this little hole. Okay. On a scale from one to ten, uh or from one to clicky, <laughs> I would give this a it can get like a seven because I don't feel like it's super duper clicky, but I don't want to say it's super duper stiff either. semi easy access to the volume on and volume off button and of course we have a raised lip in the front so y'all know what that means if we lay this bad boy flat we is protected so what would y'all rate this case on a scale from 1 to 10 honestly I like it I like that it's a bulky case I feel like that's what I mainly like about it like yes it's clear but I'ma just be 100% you know, honest with y'all. Let's keep this a buck 50 because y'all know I don't play that up over here. I don't like it as much as I thought I would. Like, I like it, it's nice, but I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep this because I don't know, like, what would I rate this case on a scale from one to 10? I would get us a 7.5, mainly because it is a bulky case and y'all know I love me a bulky case. And I know it's gonna be super duper protective, but Honestly, I feel like it just took too long for me to put this on. Yes, I feel like, you know, maybe maybe if I would have read the instructions, it wouldn't have took that long, you know, <laughs> but we're not talking about that right now. I feel like if one of y'all was to go out and get this, and if you read the instructions, maybe it won't be so hard for you to, like, you know what I'm saying, put it on, and you maybe like it. Like, I don't feel like it's a bad case or anything. I do still feel like it's budget-friendly if we compare it to the original out of box case which is like 70 bucks this is about 25 so if you're looking for something bulky something where you can you know see the color of your iphone and it'll be super duper protected i do feel like this would be the case for you because as y'all can see look how thick this is i feel like if i threw this phone at somebody they would be hurt well granted if i threw this phone at somebody without a case on it they'd still be hurt because this phone is heavy it's y'all know so, what are y'all thoughts? Let me know down in the comment section below. Let's do our famous drop test. Let me fix this. I feel like this phone with this case on it can do some damage. Like, it do feel super duper rugged. Like, I feel like I'm ready to go do anything with this phone. If I drop this phone outside, I know it will be protected. Like, just by how it feels. And I know what you're thinking, like, hmm, how do you know that? 
if we compare it to the thin flimsy on cases that I normally unbox which is the pretty ones yeah this one feels like a totally different case like all together like on some for real stuff let's go ahead and try this clip on too um so this thing right here is not staying down so i'm gonna have to minus five points from it so take it from a 7.5 to just a seven because come on y'all really or do y'all feel like i'm nitpicking like i'm not nitpicking i don't mm -mm. Mm -mm. Oh, hold on did i get it to go down i did I get them a five points back. <laughs> so this is how it looks with the clip. But I mean, who's actually like, I don't know. I, I don't see a purpose for the clip. That's just me. Yep. So it'll be protected if you use it with a clip, I guess. Okay, so this is the clip. Okay, so this is the clip. I know I keep saying it, but I really would like to know y'all thoughts on this super duper rugged on case. Like, I can't believe how thick this is. Like, this thickness, they getting a 20 out of 10 because I love this. I don't know, it's just something about it. Like, I like it, but I don't like it that much. Would I recommend y'all get it? Yes, I would still recommend this, especially for somebody who is super duper clumsy with their phone and don't mind a case being like really bulky. <laughs> then yes, I would recommend it. Now, if you're not clumsy with your phone, like yours truly, and you don't really like bulky cases, I would suggest you go ahead and watch another one of my own case unboxings because one of those may be more of your flavor. So, with that being said, we can actually get ready and wrap up this video in the next clip. So, if you made it to the end of today's video, yes I see you, and yes I do appreciate you. If y'all want to see more content just like this and from me on my channel in the future, y'all know what y'all need to be doing. Yes, I met y'all at the beginning, but you know I love you, man, y'all. At the end, do not forget to go ahead and give uh, this video a huge thumbs up, because it does let me know that y'all are interested in this type of content here on my channel, and y'all definitely trying to see some more in the future it will also help push me and my channel into a wider audience so we can hit 1400 little hearts aka 1400 plus subscribers here on my channel so we can continue growing here on youtube also y'all know the drill y'all know what's coming next do not forget to go ahead and subscribe below because you already know i do post two times a week and i never ever 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 miss an upload yes y'all can me on that but before i let y'all go i have to let y'all know that i do love and appreciate every single last heart here on my channel y'all know y'all forever in my heart and i will see y'all in my next upload